mothers were women, women bullied me. That me, I want to bring Christian down. That my child was sick. I should go and investigate what killed my child. Instead of me to go and do tests for my other children, I'm here running my mouth. Your child died. You are here wearing gold. You want to show the world. You want to taste. You want to cause. I said, no. Oh, women like me. If it was men, I would, I would say, well, it would be your fault. You never push me for you. Know what? Women like my DM bashing me seriously. How much could you have been paid to rejoice over a 12 year old death? A 12 year old. Oh, my team, oh, that's it. That's it, baby. I carried a pregnancy for 10 months. I pushed. I labored for hours. At the point, I was begging Dr. Sito to please help me. He said, very are a premier, you are a first time mother. You cannot interfere too much in your labor. Please. Your body can carry it. Just manage. I did what? I did at the point of the wrong match. Because she was a big baby. I pushed her out. God kept her for me. Mommy, you couldn't one year, you couldn't two years. She died at 12. And people had the guts to bash me. Somebody said I was chasing clouds. Somebody said Christian gave dates. Christian said she was sick and they backed their claims up with dates. This woman is just chasing clouds. I came on social media to make noise. I came on social media to draw attention because what fell boom money. But I said, this Allah, if really you are dead, I, your mother, will get you justice. Christian will answer me, they will tell me what killed my child. A 12 year old does not just stop and die. And I begged them. I don't want to open her up. People were like, hey, you don't want to do a toxic. So what do you want? You want money? Is it money you want? You don't want to do autopsy. What then do you want? I didn't want to do autopsy because I googled how autopsy is done. It's horrendous. It's not something anybody should put their children through. You don't push it on anybody. I was begging them. Tell me. Just investigate. They said they don't know. I said, okay. You said she didn't faint in the she didn't collapse in a private place. She collapsed in a public place. Can you please ask? My husband asked, just help us investigate. Ask around. We are hearing rumors of electrocution. They refused. And my wife looked me straight in the eye and said, One with me, I promise you she was not electrocuted. That machine was not even plugged. It was not working. And I said, Mr. Mao, how can you promise what you, you you said you were not there? How can you make such a promise? And immediately, one of the men that came, one of the Awashika sons, he took it off from me. He said, Madam, you know what? Go and do autopsy. Go and do autopsy. And I said, I don't want to do autopsy. I don't hear you. He said, There is no smoke without fire. The smoke now is that there was electrocution. Could you please help me trace if there's any truth? If they had gone and come and tell me, Mom, with me, you know, we have passed around, we have made some investigations, and we believe she was likely electrocuted. We are really sorry it happened under our care. We promise to support you in any way we can. I'll bury my child. I had already paid for the burial site. I had already bought a casket. You know that we do. There is no parents that praise that. Oh, my God, I'm not sure. I did my live video on Thursday. The day I was done, I was not saying, you know what? We bury her tonight. And that was it. Because everything was ready. You only called the guys. Okay, we're coming tomorrow. Put the date, 2nd of March. Every other thing was ready. As I was done with that live video by 8:30, he said, so we'll this girl tomorrow. It was not as if we had one elaborate plan in our head. We were we were ready to bury at any point. And people were asking me, eh, why are you off social media? Why are you making noise? Go off social media. Your child died. I'm on social media. That's my fighting ground. That's my battle ground. I cannot be social media. I came for the man advice tomorrow. I will not play social media. That is my battleground. She people were investigating my child, that my child was sick. So people were praying that the doctor should come out to show she was sick. 
A woman came and was telling me, ah, well, education can happen anywhere. It was a mistake. My child now is in year nine. My child is in year nine. Yes. My child is in year nine. And they are just at home. They can't do exams. They can't do anything. They are just at home. We just wish this whole thing is over. Because of the case. So the woman is... She is blaming me. She is blaming me. People are not Somebody commented and said, Why would they close the school down for one child? Hey, one child, yeah, you're more than me. Yeah, that's all I tell me. I beg them, don't let me do an autopsy. All I can imagine in my head is machetes hitting my child. I don't know what they used, but I know it is not a knife, it is not a soft knife. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Down to her guts. They handed it over to me, kidney, liver, lungs, brain. One young one, what you have for a year, or they have brain cancer. And somebody is telling me that I should, I should not fight. Ah! Broke her head, broke her leg to get married. Broke her head to get out of the brain. And a mother, a woman like myself, is telling me, you are picking that on social media, can you manage it? A God judge. A God judge. This man should be ready to kill me. He be killed with Thomas F. for a day. If the Nigerian police tries to rubbish with me, maybe not for help from Bobo Georgia, because I'm not going to stop. They will give me answers. They will tell me why my child was murdered. Have they seen you after the autopsy? And my wife was here before yesterday. When the result of the autopsy came, yeah, normally when they see me at the home, when the police were allowed to come and write to the home, only me and my husband went. Because there was no cell phone. They came with plenty, as in they came as an answer. They came with a full house. Ah! What is going on? I am La Barista, La Baja, for Christland. I am Dr. San Engineer for Christland. I am Shekinah for, for Christland. They were they came with a, a full chamber. Why? Just to write statements. You finish writing statements. When they are under it for something else, they came with the same flint. We later got to know Mama's son has a law chamber. Yes. One of their worshippers has a law chamber. So they are ready for me. Yes. They are ready. But there is no problem. But God is more than ready. There are more with me than against They know. They also had a pathologist at the at the hotel. So they know what happened. The day before yesterday, the principal was here. She said she came to mend relations. I was telling her because I said I wish you slapped her. If we see on the road, we should still be able to be able to do it. How can Told me yesterday, the amount of pain the human heart can take is scary. I don't want to know. If anybody ever told me this kind of pain existed, I'll say it's a lie. Ah, women, women were in my DM talking. We humans were resilient. The woman said her husband and her son was killed in her presence by robbers. And I cried. How do you survive? How how are you alive? The whole Nigeria we need therapy. Yes. We need therapy. What we see, what we go through, is not normal. If this school had come out, it would have saved me a whole lot of trauma. Maybe now, just say, oh, sorry, I've been offline. I lost my paper. I've been running. Okay, and it would have just. I posted that.
I'm dealing with the trauma of seeing her lifeless. I'm dealing with the trauma of imagining what she went through during autopsy. I'm dealing with, with so many trauma. Trauma of, of parents that were actually rejoicing. A celebrity called me and told me, Ah, madam, I won't be able to say much until the autopsy is out because they've already sent a letter to us that the child was sick. Oh, Chris Lamb sent a letter to people. Chris Lamb left you. If you know anybody in Christland Lake, please ask them. I don't want to mention no, 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 no. If you know people that have their children in Christland Lake, in your circle, ask them. No. I sent a letter I called on the level that I don't want to it. I got that call on the top. He said, I'm going to go. I'm sick. I'm going to go. 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 But what's a fun trip? Even if they got a letter. Yes, even if they got a letter. When I was in primary school, I had, I had students, pupils oh, that would just come to school and say, Yes! We have people, pupils that would come to school and, you know, just whatever. It doesn't yes. mean that you now return their dead bodies to their parents and say because they were sick. Mm. I've been mean, called several times. I've come and picked them because somebody's sick. Yeah, yeah. 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 and they'll come to school and die. And I'll take them to the hospital and they'll be back to school. I have been called one day, sir. My daughter Kaima, who she's having a picture, she should need comfort. Kaima left him with me. And I, my kids, I, I knew their schools are, I have, I knew their schools are, are near me. That was, I was skeptical about her for going to a baby. But I said, she's not a teenager. She will learn resilience. Oh my, she will learn how to wake up on time. My daughter looks up at five, five thirty, every day. How I knew that once she goes up, I get. It was paining the both of us. Her father had a very soft spot for this one. Very soft spot. There was a day he came back by the one. We had a meeting of our night. He came back by the one or the two. I was here with him. We he rang the bell. I opened the door. We were here talking. My daughter came down dressed in full uniform. What? Full uniform. My father said, What happened? He said, Ah, I'm going to be a big break. My father carried out and cried. He cried. Ah! Oh! He said, You can't go to sleep when you came home. I left both of them here. He carried out and left till 4 a.m. I said, Let's go to the family. It's almost the family. So he was not happy she, was, she had to leave home that early. That early. But we were believing that. It's for a good cause. Yes. For three, by the time she's done, by the time she's in year nine, she will learn how to be responsible yes. as well. And they have the effort to, if they employ people low, I think they pay people low, they pay me. But I know God is on the throne. The result was clear because the government has posted it. Everyone, man. Yes. Uh, yes. The God says it's a wound. They said they're going to take legal action against Islam. It it's, 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 it's need to, because it's becoming too frequent. And the next time, and they're taking things for granted because of time. Because of time, because this time is it. Passes. Because they government, the results, the post mortem report revealed the cause of death to be asphyxia and electrocution. Yes, yes. It was not maybe. Not maybe. It's very you know, there was a voice yeah. recording of the no. child. Yeah. Her friend. Um, yes, that was the first thing. Yes, that was the first thing. After I saw her video, the next thing I saw. A voice recording of a child saying, ah, mommy, Whitney was electrocuted or that she died there. Don't you know? That was a voice recording. Mm. That it was so not just electrocution is a mistake. It's, it's not in time. We know so everybody so knows it's not so true. It's not yes. intentional. Yes. Really. Like, that means they are full of evil. They have plans. Yes. Yes. I think I think we Nigerians were on default mode. Like I said, we are always on default mode to attack in the, in the name of defense. Right. Always, exactly. Yeah. Our guns are always default. Default. Okay. Yes. We're always default. 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 Yes. 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 Default. default. Yes. That's what they want to do. I'm like, I'm sorry. 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 i am sorry i am sorry i am sorry i am sorry Things that have happened in the country. Now, it's kind of make people a lot more dark in their hearts. Imagine what's just happening. Everything is just keep happening back and forth. When you think you've experienced one thing, Nigeria should be another shaking. Oh, it's just, either collectively or individually, Nigeria will show you shaking. 
So you think you are you 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 rock bottom. Yeah. You are trash. So so nobody gives you any money. Just you are like that. Be strong. Just I think you should go be turning off your comment yes. section. Yes. Yeah, just turn off your comment section. It's not even on my own comment section. If you don't my question, I will delete the comment. It's on other blogs. Mr. Blog. Ignore that. You know 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 that. Because I commend your strongness. I have yeah. to commend you. I cannot be crying up and down, be yeah. rolling on the ground. I cannot just yeah. out as being hysterical. I won't be taken yeah. serious. I can't be taken yeah. serious. I have to maintain my composure. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> I mean, you must have the support. I will not be until the support that I come. I hope you support me. I appreciate that. I have it's yeah, been emotionally yeah. draining. Like mm. I remember you guys granted five interviews. Five interviews. At every point I had to recount what happened. At every point I had to recount what happened. At the point I nearly collapsed. What about that? I had to go to the stadium with the with these people. It was like reliving the horror all over you. It's been emotionally well, let's have a picture last week. If I ask somebody, I will point gun at him. I tell him, ah, welcome. Did you see him? Okay. Oh, okay. Last week, I said, ah, life is not okay. I didn't remember I had the heart for that. I didn't remember I had the hospital. I didn't remember that my death would cause anybody to pain. All I wanted was, let me end this. This pain, it's a pain that you feel physically. Like your chest is trying to pain you because you are feeling pain. Mm -hmm. 